This fitting down here is to remove the condensate. Again, on a condensing water heater, the unit produces condensate, so we need to remove it. So this is our, our drain. This is a barbed fitting, and in here we would hook a tube or a nylon hose, and we were either going to go to a floor drain, or we're going to go to a condensate pump where we will pump the condensate to an external wall and outside. In some areas, they may have you drain it into a, a common drain, and in those cases, you're going to need a condensate neutralizer, and we do offer those, and that takes the acidity out of the water, makes it neutral, and makes it safe to dump into drains. Will not rot the waste pipe and cause any further damage. Condensing appliances have one thing in common. They all need to remove the condensate. Condensate is a water vapor derived from the combustion process and or from atmospheric rain that may get into the venting. So what we have here on this appliance is our exhaust elbow here where we remove the exhaust and we have our exhaust tubes within the internal parts of the tank. The water vapor is condensed inside the tank, runs down and is trapped underneath this exhaust elbow. And we also have a clear tube here. This is our P-trap so this will keep the water trapped for you so it's not unusual to see water in this at all time. And as we talked about, condensate from combustion process is very acidic and in some cases we may need to add a condensate neutralizer, which we will show you now. Here is the outlet to our condensate drain. Of course, it is lower than the, the trap itself. It needs to drain either into a floor drain or perhaps into a pump if we need to pump it out. Again, as we mentioned, condensate from the combustion process is acidic. In order to neutralize it, to dump it into some drains, it may be required to add a condensate neutralizer, which I have here. These are simply marble chips that, as you can tell, as the condensate goes through here, they will erode and it is rechargeable. So during our annual maintenance, we will take a look at this, make sure it's still filled with marble chips, and replace if necessary. The other thing that we want to be real attention to on the condensate is we want it to drain away from the unit. We do not want it to drain back, so we recommend about a quarter inch per foot draining away to into either our floor drain or into a condensate pump. 